course. It's a long video. <laughs> I always say that just to kind of get off the joking and everything. But yeah. Um, we got some new news. I probably got some sleep. There you go. Just came up for it. We got a little bit more or just bus news. Not that really much important news really that much today. But I was like, yeah, I got enough to make a video. I might as well just make one. So it doesn't matter. Because we got a new illustration for um, spring slash like April of 2023 for Sonic. They usually do a new art piece every month. They did last year, though. Last year, the ones were really good. We had, like, Rouge and Sonic and Eggman Land. Uh, we had um, Sonic and Cream. <laughs> kind of like a little daycare. We had Sonic and Silver. In like um, in the valley, I think we had Vector and Sonic and Wimbo and um, Unleashed Wimbo, um, Apatos. I think we had like me and Sonic going into Twinkle Park, which actually was really funny. Again, a lot of little new illustration stuff though. But I got a lot of recordings to do today. I have to really focus with the game, but I don't have a lot to do, so it's it, it's kind of crazy though what I have to do today. But yeah, of course, we got new news, we got new stuff. Again, like I said, nothing crazy, crazy, crazy though. But this is a new art illustration we got of Silver and Alyssa this year. Uh, for um, this month of um, April, because like I said, they do a new one every month, pretty much. And I actually do like it though. We got silver a new outfit and skating boots against the Olympic Games, and at least back though, so that's not bad though. It's cute. And of course, we got some um, slowly on in the background. What is there? Slash Pagonia? Question mark? Just getting that, of course. But it looks nice though. I like it though. Something a little different. But they get a tail channel, of course, on like and, um, all characters, of course, for all the info. So we do have some new crossover stuff. We do have a little more origin screenshots. We have um, the um, Game Gear games and stuff like that, of course. We got some new screenshots for them. And we got a whole bunch of new stuff in here, though. So, um, yeah. Um, but yeah, going back to Origins Plus, I think we found some new info right here. So it says official Japanese release, Japanese release, Sonic Origins, um, microsite, newly refreshed, newly refreshed for Origins Plus, which pretty much the updated to Origins Plus assets. Has I mentioned that upcoming update applied that the upcoming update applied to the new bug fixes through the um, extents of the fixes that have not yet been known. So pretty much again, this is going to be bug fixes for this new update coming up. Again, I feel like it's going to be kind of like how Mania Plus was, where basically all you have to do is just update the game, slash buy the DLC, because you can literally do it on the PS Plus store, you can literally just buy the DLC for like two bucks. And that's pretty much it for um, Mania Plus though. You don't get the like, dark book unless you like, unless you don't have a copy of Origins, which I'm glad I did wait though. But again, like I said, it's, it's nothing like crazy though, but now that, we have a play now that we actually have a playable Amy officially confirmed in the game and everything, that's, I think that's really cool and nice. Honestly though, but yeah, we got a lot of new stuff though, honestly, just so much new stuff for my content in the next few days though, so, yeah, it's gonna be insane and fun though, of course though, but yeah, of course, but yeah, um, pretty much new bug fixes, new blow assets, probably like assets updates and stuff like that are coming for that, so it's not bad, I like that pretty much. What else we have here? We have new screenshots, of course it says, there's a new official screenshots for Amy and Knuckles playable on Sonic Origins, because originally, Knuckles was not playable in Sonic CD, originally, but now with the new plus update, they actually made that possible. Of course, Amy looked like she'd be playable in all the games, because she saw her playable in Sonic 1, 2, 3, and Knuckles, of course. But Sonic 3 and Knuckles, I still consider that one game, because technically it was really this one game, so. Even though the games got split in half, cartridges, because McDonald's still, typical stuff. We do the whole thing, we know Sicko, we know everything, just kidding though, of course. But yeah, uh, now we have a playable Amy, of course, Sonic 1, 2, 3, and CD. And so is Knuckles as well, though, he played on Sonic CD, <laughs> as Sicko said. But yeah, we got new screenshots, we got Knuckles and Quartz Squadron, which is really cool. Again, it's going to be different, though, again, probably not as much gameplay difference. But again, like I said, I probably wouldn't do levels, levels and layouts. Like, they did the Taxman version of Mobile for Sonic, um... Two, where they made the layouts level a little different, like that elemental shield, so it makes marble garden less volcano proof. Tails' level is a little different, and act two in marble as well. Um, marble, I said marble, marble, same thing. I switched them out a lot though, so yeah, because the screenshots said um, we, have some, well, we have more screenshots right here as well. Visual screenshots of Game Gear titles and Sonic Origins Plus 12, play 12. Classic Sonic Game Gear game titles. Uh, play, play twelve classic Sonic Game Gear titles. I think I said that right. On modern platforms, including hits like Sonic Drift Two, which sucked. Just kidding. Sonic Two and Sonic and Tails Two. <laughs> I like that. And Tails Adventure and Tails Sky Patrol something too. Again, we got the screenshot and like new info and everything for that when that got released though. So um yeah we got um look at Sonic going down Ice Cab. It's Sonic. I think it's Sonic and I guess Sonic Three Game Gear. I know Sonic 1 and 2 Game Gear are pretty difficult though, because yeah, I love when Sonic gets kind of crazy. I mean, I guess like, isn't it? It's not full screen wide support though. It's just in the little. You can. It's like the. It's like you can. It's like you could go to widescreen on. Sonic. 
one, two, and three, or you can switch to the four by you can switch you can switch to the sixteen by nine layout, which is full screen pretty much, or the four by nine, four, no four by three, which is pretty much OG layout like this. But yeah, again, they don't have like proper borders to support the full screen. Again, these games were not meant to be full screen anyway, so. But yeah, um, why did I open that up twice? I think because I had yeah I had two different ones. Okay, I think I, think I know why I did that. Okay. So we've been doing a little crossover here for Herokin. Um, pretty much something I guess in there too. His Herokin was a was a minor celebrity back on Earth thanks to his cosplay and charity work. But after his uh, elevate uh, executed to the Tyrant, um, he had turned to those same skills towards more n more nefarious nefarious spots. Okay. So pretty much Sonic cosplay. Oh, well, I like that though. We got Tails, we got Knuckles, we got Sonic, uh, Amy right there. We got the full Sonic layout, the shoes, and the Sonic movie. I like it though. It's, it's kind of funny though. But yeah, it's, it's like the first Sonic movie design. But just if it went down, if the Sonic, if the first Sonic movie design was the actual thing in a different universe. And again, the first Sonic movie design is pretty much this. <sighs> like if we kept, if we had the first Sonic movie design was the actual, if it. It probably was in this <laughs> universe. Yeah, cool. Hero King. Okay. Oh, yeah, okay. Armed with um, special D modded. Um, my modified camera to capture a target's look. Uh, I read this already, the same stuff. A target's likeness and cosplay as them Hero King, Hero Kai, can be used his pinch, pension and. This group to elevate the reds in this plot. I can't try to speak. I'm not trying to speak to The environment in heinous as only the sharpest eyed rival will be able to detect the clues to reveal his him as an imposter. Okay. So pretty much it's just something to cosplay in this because I know we have like a full trailer right here. For I, um right here. For um sake and everything, of course, so I like that though. Hey, can I pause it please? But yeah. This four. Yeah, it's an FPS game. Okay, that's not bad, though. Pretty much like I got another that's not a crossover, pretty much. Oh, what else we have in here? Yeah, Sonic like again, full widescreen and everything, of course. The coins are still there, the time is still there, the rings are still there. Um, score's still there and everything. What else is in here? It's only like drifting, it's full, um, again, like I said, it's not full widescreen support, which obviously makes sense, because, again, they can't really, um, games are not really authorized for full screen. They really, they're really, they're made for like Game Gear little handhelds to keep Sonic alive, I guess. Can I say that technically? Get this franchise a little alive? I don't know. But yeah. Of course, we got the map layouts. Just kind of just slowly going through all the screenshots we got here. Tales Adventure, Tales Sky Patrol Adventure, Tales Adventure 2. There you go. <laughs> I think someone said Big Fishing Adventure 3. Coming in 2024. No, it's 2042. It was an April Fool's joke. It was, I think I did, like, I covered that, like, years ago on my channel. Like, back in, like, 2019, I kind of thought about that. Uh, of course, we got additional elements for Sonic Origins right here. So it's, even, it's even more powerful, including the new elements added to the package in the version. The package version of Sonic Origins plus additional DLC expansion pack. Many glitches and actions and action behaviors have been fixed. Some of the special, some of the special, um, uh, specifications have been improved based on the user's player uh, reports. Hmm. Okay, I don't really play Sonic Origins at all though, because it's, it's a game that's like, I'll pick it up later. Kind of glad I, kinda glad I am picking up late. It's really getting the Mania Plus treatment though, so kind of glad about that. Oh yeah, this is um, new here as well. Uh, I actually don't want to, I'm going to cover that in a second. Um, IDW has a new, um, I forgot IDW has a new um, cover coming up as well though. I think it's issue 62? Okay, it was. It says, join on the latest set of misadventures in the brand new Sonic uh, story arc, including it's st starting here in an issue who's 62 and running full speed through 66, so oh, lordy. Two, three, four, five, six. It's probably like five issues. Two, three, four, five, six. Four or five issues. We got the Eggman um, and Surge submitted, um, submerged, sub substained. For now, Sonic gets friends have a chance to relax. We're set in the plan for the future. For his Amy visits Knuckles and Age Island to return Relic to the island as probably the master emerald because Knuckles is probably chilling. I like the reference to other generations because of the grapes. Um, as well as a few surprises in store for them as they catch up. Which we've already seen the you know, new IDW five year anniversary coming up as well for that though. So I'll probably talk about that in a future video. So we'll <laughs> already. 
it's gay enough, of course. Meanwhile, Manic, um, Mick, I'm not gonna talk about it's um, pulling together the perfect, uh, like that cat little reference everyone's credit her, um, disguise to impersonate the rest restoration. I'm not gonna try to pronounce that. Yeah, June 2023. Okay, makes sense because all something that happens. Also, yeah, we do have the new um, Mania Plus, um, Origins Plus, I'd say the same thing. Little new record right there. We got the background and stuff like that. Of course, we got Sonic 3 and Knuckles. Pretty much like I said, getting the Mania treatment with the classic, you know, Japanese pretty much promo look of um, how it used to look pretty much. Yeah, we got the Game Gear CD, Sega Saturn, Sonic 3 and Knuckles, the little walk on cartridge. I like that. That's cute. Um, I guess pretty much it, though, honestly, for that. Um, yeah, we got new origins, more stuff though. We got new screenshots, we got new um, everything. I actually did switch my format back because I forgot it always does that. But yeah, it looks really clean. I love it though. With really the classic sub Japanese, you know, Sonic logo and everything. Um, but like I said, it's just a sample. Like I said, it could subject to change. We've seen it already in the trailers, but it could change or whatever though. So, yeah, it's pretty much everything I want to kind of cover and go over though today. But thank you to um, Tales Channel, of course, all the info, the Sonic and all the characters. Thank you for all the screenshots and news we got though, of course. Again, like, it doesn't like really crazy, crazy, but I still like to cover Sonic news when I can because no one really kind of covers it. I mean, you know, they, they do, but in that compilation video, it's like I do. Those are actually be also all separate though, but in general, I like to cover like all the little news that no one really ever covers. You guys still like it though, and I like that though. So yeah, see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Great luck. Okay, take care though. Stay safe. Wash hands. God bless all of you. Of course, I'll put on a wear mask. So be prepared for you too. Best if you can go outside to subscribe. It could be on channel for all my friends to discourse. So every freaking week, that's awesome. So wait, what you guys think about all this info though, of course, like, you hit it again, very simple, very easy stuff, like I said, though, I got so much stuff that I'm, I'm way behind because of work and everything, but otherwise, I'm gonna get it done, try to go those videos, record it as soon as I can, see you guys are looking though. Uh -huh.